Let's learn how to play this curve. Alright. I see. Boop. Alright, so the shift is the C4. Flap. <laughs> Got it. Like, if you're on the ground, you don't, like, get pushed up. It's kind of like Rex's shift a little bit. Rex Reload 7 PF2. Yeah, I think this is the same group or person who made um, the TF2 soldier mod, so not surprised. Is busted. Yeah. <laughs> Can I... Oh, nice. Okay, I see. <laughs> it's a pretty big explosion, too. I think this is supposed to be like, you know, rocket loader, basically, so... Have you played as Jinx before? No, I'm not gonna play as any of the League of Legends characters, sorry. I can't promote that sort of thing on my stream. League is illegal in this country, yeah. <laughs> oh, the cooldown for the explosive, like the M2 is really fast, actually. I should just be using that a lot. It's like Soldier from TF2. I think I'm gonna hear that a lot today. <laughs> this is gonna be fun to fight Emerald with. Don't slip. Ooh, the backup mag for this character seems uh, interesting. Actually, if League is illegal, could you call it illegal? Hold on, I need to ban someone in chat. Thanks. As far as busted, the survivor does seem very busted. Ooh, time to move, dude. Let's power creep than runner somehow. <laughs> Which is kind of crazy. A Baldrum. I hope the Secret of the Storm characters aren't going to be super strong. They will. <laughs> I don't know if they can actually be stronger than Railgunner. I don't know if that's physically possible, but to be stronger than Void Fiend, maybe. Uh, this character was really fun to pillar skip with, I and mean, we'll see. I don't know if I can get enough speed to pillar skip that way. I see him works for his rockets. What? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why would they do that? Oh, the tree? I mean, maybe. I really want to get ICBM then. Wonky run. I'll take it. I think it'll be able to some point or something. I wonder if I could stop my fall damage from any distance. I mean, it feels like you just blast and you'll be fine. So. No, there's a mount train, but didn't. You can chain together jumps before the ship and then use the momentum to line yourself up. Maybe. I mean, try it. Oh, we're zooming. You can play this with an afterburner? Probably, yeah. I would still need, like, a backup mag or two, though. I like the M2 on the rockets. That's actually a really good idea. I don't really like backup mags with this. Needs up there. Can't really get it. Oh, bye bye. Miss jumping. Opa. Beautiful, I need you. Uh oh, stop. I have wings in case anything bad happens with the rocket jumping. Hopefully nothing bad happens. <laughs> okay. It did. Nice. A gas burner. I actually kind of like the idea of a gas burner here. We'll see. Let's test our ability to jump down. There we go. Flap. There are two shrines we didn't fully get. Oh, hello. Um. Nice. ATGs, just send him in. He's in the wall. Thanks. Another ban. Word shell. Is this tire side affected by yellow S? Uh, definitely seemed to be. Usually I don't really notice, but that seemed like it was. First time getting a stream, been getting into the Eclipse grind, but since I'm on console, I can't get guaranteed bans every run. Do you have any tips for dealing with lacking damage? The best tip for building damage is just to diversify your damage as much as humanly possible, right? For example, I know this isn't gonna be like an everyday scenario, but like, if you have like a watch printer or a crit printer, 
a lot of people would be like, oh, I'm gonna just go into watches, you know, and call it in. But if you do both, you actually get like a billion times more damage, right? So try to get as many different damage types as you can, please. Alright, that was all of my money. <laughs> my friend shouldn't be that expensive yet. Bye bye. <laughs> Give me. Eh, okay. We got him. I need to fly. I have wings in my inventory. Scrapper, finally. Well, yeah. No. Get the thing, dude. I think I want wings more than base at the moment. Power elixir, I'm not really crazy about it. The AoE is just so gross. Why you don't want that either? Ubo? Ubo Rocket seems like it could fuck shit up. Oh, I'm broke. Is that a cloak chest right here? Yeah, it is. Good. And it's speed, too. Let's get this first. I'm not doing another scavenger bingo event. Hmm. I can tell you that we currently do not have any plans to do that, no. Will it ever happen? Can't say. As of right now, we're not working on it at all. Oh, well, good. Looks like we're gonna have to... We don't have to get the gun, or farm for the gun, but... Gun is useless here, in my opinion, because Sulfur pulls and you have a car. A uh, gun is not useless, because we have a recycler, and we can turn it into any boss item we want. Uh, I think I'm just gonna start rolling now. Um, alright. Fucking moving. We're gonna have a lot to get rid of here on the stage. I thought the rocket jumping would be a lot uh, crazier, actually. I mean, it's not, like, not crazy, but... That'd be, like, loader level, like... Cross map type shit. Oh, we don't need that. Give? Sure. Bang Strider. Can I get some ATGs, please? This is like, the shift is like, almost like a grenade. Almost like Commando's grenade. Eh, oh, good. Is there a Cradle this stage? I don't remember. I thought there was, but... Oh yeah, there is, right here. Where's the scrapping? Found it. Alright, everything's gotta go. Too many slugs. I actually keep that, might as well. I'm gonna roll it. Ah. <laughs> oh! Okay. I forgot I could re roll that one. Um. Hmm. It's gonna be wild. We're gonna have to rocket jump to avoid Umbral. Which I guess is. You know, the character, so... No feather? What, uh, what stream do you think this is? If I can get every item I want, except the feather. It's crazy. I'll uh, take one. Yes, thank you. Can I get damage? <laughs> I have an ATG and a lot. The bands are nice, but... Sign up all the time. There's a scrap of the stage, let's get rid of him. Don't do it. Thank you. If I don't fall off the stage, I can always just like bring myself back up like that. You rework some of the worst times to make them more useful, and if so, how would you do it? That's that's a lot of a question. Um mainly just like I don't know. I would actually rework some of the better items to 
I think some of the good items are too good. Like, saver spaces. Uh-huh. Need. Whatever. What is happening? <laughs> okay. Oh, no, I mean, it feels like it. Why do you think the reds are underwhelming? I think they kind of pictured them being better and they just ended up not being that way. I just think it kind of ends up being like a playtest problem. I don't know. Because you look at Risk of Ring Returns or Risk of Ring 1, and uh, reds in that game are way more fun, actually. You'd think they'd be more fun in this game, too, but kind of build dependent. They are. But they just wind up not being good because those builds are trash, unfortunately. Reds and Risk Grand 2 are either incredible or dog shit. Yeah, like the best reds in this game far outweigh the reds in returns, right? But um the reds that are bad in this game are worse than like a white item in returns. Or even in this game. Yummy. Sure. Uh, we need to go in. I mean, they just tell me it's better in two. Yeah, because you just have more agency over your build. You don't really have agency over your build in returns. So, which is something that I know a lot of people are kind of divided on. I don't really think it's too big of a deal, given the game plays the way it does, but, you know. Unless you're a Psycho Drifter, yeah. Ow! Like a fucking crab. Do I want a shuriken? Not really. What do you want out of a survivor in Secret of the Storm? You know what I actually want? I think I want a uh, more of a support style character, like Returns had, like with Chef and Drifter and stuff. Being able to share some power between you and your teammates is really fun. And it was good for Solo too. Like either you take all the power or you spread it around. I like that kind of stuff. Robomando? Yeah, something like just like cool like that. That's just like a little bit different. It's not just like, hey, this character shoots in a new way. Something with like a a unique utility, I think. Like Rocket's kinda cool, but it's just like, you know, new ways to shoot. Which is fine. But it's not what I'm looking for in the future. I just add Drifter. Adding Drifter would be fucking sick. I would love that. I don't know what they're gonna do though. We'll see. Rander's my favorite. I think Rander is close to being my favorite, but Drifter and Perry Merc are just too fucking cool, dude. That field medic from the gotcha game? I mean, honestly, they might do some shit like that. I can see it. They're just like, oh, play the gotcha game. You added a character from it? It means the gotcha game's also really good. And you're like, damn. I bet it, it has to be good. I'm gonna download it. Dude, chat, what if you could earn, like, the the currency for the gacha game by playing Risk of Rain 2? If you, like, beat Mythrix, you can get some fucking... Giga loot. <laughs> and then they made it so mods don't work in this game. What do you think about that? <laughs> As well. Oh, there we go. Ugh. Void Cradle is the last thing left, I think. Oh, you actually, like, conserve momentum. Interesting. Ow. <laughs> you hurt me. Um, we do have fields as an option. We could do it. I'm kind of low on damage, so I might... End up doing fields here. Let's go check out fields. Is there fall damage? Yes. Well, we have 17 scrap. Wowie. I'm gonna get a few. Miss our speed right now. Oh, that's fine. That's more than enough. Uh, you. Be gone. Dude, I, I'm gonna get rid of my Chrono because you do have four greens. Do you need stun? Oh, um, I mean, I don't know, I like stun for the moon a little bit. Or stage five, we'll see. I'll 
take it. If you had to have a physical prop of any item in the game, what would you pick? That's a hard question. I mean, a Dio's is an easy one, right? Maybe just as like a joke, a feather, but I don't know. Mocha? I mean, I think you just go get a Mocha. <laughs> I think you have that option. I'll avoid Cradle. Alright, well. If we can get some items here, it'd be kind of nice. Aegis? Fuck you. Oh, nice. Don't even make me say the word Aegis, because it will show up. Can Mythos get Drone Man? No. Only on console. Wow, what a reroll. Uh, the thing is, like, Gearbox needs to learn the same lessons that, uh, that Hopu did, that that is a bullshit item on the enemies, so. Yeah, we did it. I love that. I mean, it's bullshit item on the player too, it is, but there's a difference, right? Like, it's so bad on console, right? Or, you know, in the very first patch that PC had, that you cannot pick it up. Because if you pick it up, like, you have to you pretty much lose if you get in a phase four at all, or you get really lucky and the drone just doesn't target you. It's really bad. Consolers, would you say that the game on console is the best state it's ever been in? Or would you say it's worse or better? Pray for all of our console brothers and sisters. Hey, I mean, they, uh, there's a life they chose. Say net neutral. I'm enjoying it. Okay. Uh, give me. All right. We're playing the rocket character. We have not really picked up a lot of damage, unfortunately. Let's see what next stage holds for us. Uh, what do I want besides that? Not really anything. I'm just gonna pick this up. A watch printer? There we go. Much better. I uh, would be Behemoth you for this character? Explosion. Same thing it does for every other character. Kirby 64 with the ability combination mechanic. Hey, can we get a Kirby mod? <laughs> That's a scrapper too. Nice. Advanced still proc with base damage increases. Oh, that's an interesting one. Yeah. That bug is very game changing for them. What do we got here? An FMP, which I can't use. Quail, huh? That'll probably help with the rocket jumps a little bit. I'll just take more speed. How about a card or something? I don't know. A gun? Thank you. I don't really want that. I'm gonna wait with that kind of stuff. We did kill a Solus unit already. Can we get another Solus unit? Elder Lemurians to fight. Ew. Uh, Stake Printer? Huge. Kind of still playable. I play because with no issues. The bugs aren't really that noticeable. These say not noticeable, but I've seen the bug list. <laughs> so. Oh my god, we found it. Holy. We're in. That's a lot of damage. Finally. Uh, yeah, we will take that. It's not right now. The second to change the rocket jump at all, it does not seem to. No. Um, egg is really good. Ooh, elephant's also really good. We have a feather, so I don't really feel like we need the. Egg? What are the egg? We'll take the elephant. I have a question, but do you think it would be a good to add a new cooldown reduction as a green or white item? No. I think cooldown reduction should stay locked to being, like, rare. Uh, but I mean, there is a cooldown reduction green item in Slice State. The Mazis? This is called Rocket. Rocket shoots rockets. Alright, I'm really just hoping for... Oh, I need to hit this. Grandparents. No. Give me a big horrors. I mean, I'll take a chirp. Don't get me wrong. I will, but... Alright. I think the drone AI needs to be reworked. Oh yeah, it's literally awful and terrible. To say rework almost implies that it does work right now, which is crazy. It's like, and like, you know, drone man made the AI work because they don't need to move around properly. Any hope for the DLC? That it works.
Oh, we got two to reroll, so odds are we get something okay. And then of course Chirp. I think we can high roll that fucking hard. All from DLC is the console did not have to wait a year and a half. So what is really unfortunate, and like as a console player you might think this is like mean of me, but dude, the fact that PC players have to wait now for console to be updated is really lame. It's PC's turn to wait like a billion years because uh, console's taking too long. But, you know, whatever. <laughs> I just realized I was actually tripling his character's rockets. Yeah, it is. Shatter Splain for what? <laughs> Maybe they just have a bigger team so they can just get shit done really quick. Who knows? Uh, I didn't reroll the egg when I was supposed to. Oops. I can just get an egg drone. Oh, shit. I'll take. Or will I say? I will. I'm still just getting stuff. So I'll have to get the scrapper. I don't think I'm gonna go anymore with the watches. So we have eight. Will I say now? Alright. Uh, now I don't really need these anymore. We don't need gas anymore. I don't have any green scraps, so I'm gonna just leave it. I don't have that much of a console player base. I have no idea the numbers on it. And it could be like a lot, really, but I just have no idea. Man, I really want that, but that's not happening. I can't give up my bands and ATGs, so. Where's like the ATG called <laughs> All right, well. Waiting for the, the bots. Alright. Alright, let's go up. I think we can probably just skip just by going up the tree or whatever, but we can also just host skip, so. I feel like I didn't get a ton of aerial movement there. Have you ever tried Titanfall 2? Nope. I've heard that it's good, but. You know, I don't really care enough to play it. New Tribes, I will never play that game. <laughs> to me, that game looks like something I would not enjoy. Destroying the orbs is great for that. Afterburner a lot. Setting up a fucking bomb.
Koi almost messed me up, actually. Had a quick jump at the end. He's flying. Isn't the timing a little bit different as well? Yeah. It's a little different. I got my quill back and almost went into the fucking uh, thing. The damage is less, but the wave comes like half a second later. Just fucking skipping along. <laughs> Alright, GG. It was fun. It was a fun Mythic fight. I have a feeling though that, like loader, the Mythos fight is gonna be very free. It's because you have so much aerial movement. Honestly though, if you're the character, good character. Very powerful. The fun mechanics, smooth thought went into the kit. Fun. <laughs>